Sorry. Sorry! We told you! 1220! Pull to the front of the lot! Look, gentlemen. I'm grateful for the bus. Really, I am. But I must ask, who are you? Shut up! Shut. Up. Because where you're going, you're gonna wish you were back in that cell. Sir. He's here. We got him. This is the easy part, Jervis. I'm telling you right now, this is the easy part. Just answer the question. Jervis! Easy part's over. Let me out of here. I ain't gonna ask again. Open up or I'll kill all you all. Well, well, well. Look who it is. Remember me? Have you touched the kneecaps? No, sir. I was just working my way down. Right kneecap. You take my money, disgrace my name, and think I will stand idly by? You have me wrong, Hannah. I didn't take your money. At least I didn't know it was yours. Don't correct me. It sickens me. Using me as a toy, parading me in front of that winged freak like a joke. I only had a share. A share? No. No, I can't. Sure you can. Would you like to walk again? Left kneecap! Nigma! 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 What have I done? What's Nigma? The person you're looking for. He, she, or it. I don't know who stole your money when you were away in Blackgate. Or how I got a share. All that was left of the money was a name, and that was it. I don't know what happened to the rest of it. Nigma. Eddie? Yeah, boss? Find everything you can on this Nigma. What about him? 
awesome. I didn't know! I didn't know it was yours! Please! Please! There are more bodies at the bottom of this river than I can count. The FOQ of the job, Sid. Body dumper. You know, I'd like to see Arnold or that dummy of his get their hands dirty. And I mean real dirty. Look at this. You know, I always wanted to be detached from this whole fever of ventriloquist empire thing. Street demons don't work for nobody, get me? Yeah, I didn't like it either. Now we gotta clean up his mess, fix his problems. Who do you think this Enigma guy is anyway? I honestly don't know. It feels like there are more colorful criminals popping up everywhere nowadays. Yeah, man. That scarecrow dude using chemicals and crap to make people crazy? Or that guy who uses his skin as a tally board for every person that he's killed. This clown liked to kidnap kids, tried to trap the bat. Didn't stand a chance. Speaking of clowns. <laughs> Not tonight. If any of this gets back to Ventriloquist, we'll end up like him at the bottom of the river. I want to put a cap on those jokers so bad. What do they think they are, acting like a bunch of maniacs? They got no class, man. I've heard rumors about their boss. Clown Prince of Crime, they say. Prince? I'll show him who's king around here. Don't get ahead of yourself. What's with you, Eddie? Always avoiding the easy route. Bullets are the best form of persuasion. Guns just aren't my weapon of choice. Yeah, I know. We got the brains. Hacking computers. There's power in technology. It can be more dangerous than a bullet. Well, I'd like to see that. We got a lot of work tracking down Nigma. Shouldn't be too hard. He could be right under our nose. It's that time.
If I take this off, will you scream? I don't like it when you scream. Makes makes my ears hurt. <laughs> so, let's just play nice, eh? Hey, Bozo. Look at the die, he came to the right place! Not looking for any trouble, just to make a deal. We're the only ones who make the jokes <laughs> around here. Come here, I'll make you laugh. <laughs> <laughs> I assume your boss was appreciative of my gift? What are you talking about? Did he not receive his share? I don't have time for riddles. Enigma? Now we're talking. Hey, Joey! There's the Enigma guy! Don't use my name. The Enigma, huh? It's been a lot of talk about you. What makes you show your face now? Exactly that. There's a lot of talk. Ventriloquist is about to explode, and I think it's time for a change in this city. Why come to us? I funded a lot of criminals with Scarface's money. But your boss caught my attention. A real mind for anarchy. I think I could be a compliment to that. Boss doesn't make deals. He doesn't even care about the money. <laughs> Neither do I. I care about seeing the wealthy and corrupt leaders of this city fall. Show them how weak they really are. And I think I have the capability to do so. Except I don't pull triggers. Your boss does, though. You do. <laughs> <laughs> Order won't change unless we take out the top. Ventriloquist. I have a plan. All your boss has to do is shake my hand and see it through. What's your plan? Have your boss call me tomorrow at this time. Let me know if he's in. If he's in, you'll know the plan. I want to be around here when the cops show up, and I suggest you do the same. How's the search for Enigma coming? Boss wants to know. I'm getting closer. Much closer. I'll brief him tonight. Man, I hope something comes of this. The more days go by, the more I think he's gonna kill me just to vent his frustrations. It's unnerving. And now, now, he's sending him love notes. You see this? What do you make of this? I'm gonna take this. Yeah? He's in. North Kenmore Garage, level A1, 1 a.m. Yo, Eddie, let's go! I'm gonna take care of this. I'll catch up with you later. I want him dead, Sid. Do you understand? Dead! What's taking so long anyways? And where's Eddie? What do you want? The question is, what do you want? To see me dead? To have your money back? Nigma? I'm gonna have your head on a stick, you coward, hiding from me! Don't let your emotions get the best of you, Scarface. I want to meet. You tell me when and where. I'll bring the coffin. 
Nurse Kenmore Garage, level A1, 1 a.m., and we'll settle this. I look forward to it. Sid, get the car. Grab my gun. Leave this up to me, Sid. I'll pump that punk up with so much lead. Come on, come on, come on. You said what I am, right? I knows what I heard. God save thee, ancient mariner, from fiends that plague thee thus. Why looks thou so? With my crossbow, I shot the albatross. Eddie? Samuel Taylor Coolridge. You've never read The Rhyme of the Ancient Mariner? Where have you been, Eddie? Shut your trap right now! I wasn't talking to you, you block of wood. I was talking to Arnold. Arnold, sir, surely you must have read such a great poem. It means so much to you, does it not? Eddie, what are you doing? The tragic tale of a man at sea who dooms his entire crew by shooting the majestic bird of the sea, the albatross. Killing an albatross brings bad luck, you see. Isn't that right, Arnold? Look at me, you no-good bum! Isn't that right, Arnold? You've had an experience with the albatross in the past. Or so your psychiatric file from Blackie tells me. Please. Please stop. Oh! So you do speak. Well, this is a first. What do you know about the albatross, Arnold? Hey! Lift me up, you dummy! I'm gonna put a bullet through both your heads! Eddie, stop! You've lost your mind! I was just a boy when my parents took me to see the albatross. It was an attraction in Gotham when it had been blown off course into the Gotham Harbor. I was terrified of it. It was gigantic! A monster! It goes on to say that your parents were killed a week later. You believe this bird is bad luck. Ah, well a day! What evil looks at I from old and young? Instead of the cross, the albatross about my neck was hung. You wear an albatross around your neck, Arnold. Protection from its bad luck. Well, I'm here to tell you that I'm that bad luck. I am your end. I am the albatross. What's going on? What's he saying? We all have fears, Arnold. You let yours get the best of you. You could have been such a great criminal. Enigma. Enigma? Eddie? You really are as dumb as you look. There you go, now you're catching on. Yes, I took the money. But think of it as a fund for a better class of criminal. More agile and effective than yourself. Some, of course, were better than others. And others, like yourself, I don't seem to understand why, are at the top of the ladder. I heard enough. Kill him. No, no, no. I've heard enough out of you, Charlie McCarthy. Let Arnold decide. Now here's your chance, Arnold. You've looked and you've searched for this scum that stole your money. Not his money. Your money. And now here he is, that scum. Go ahead, Arnold, pump him up with lead. Listen to yourself, Arnold. Not him.
Did you check if you were loaded before you left? <laughs> Number one rule in the crime world, always be packed. What are you waiting for? Kill him! Eddie, what are you doing? I'm doing things my way now, Sid. The self-same moment I could pray, and from my neck so free. The albatross fell off, and sank like lead into the sea. Aw, that's so sweet! Can we cut the poetry? Say your goodbyes and get it over with. You okay, Puddin? Didn't hit you, did I? No. Good! Now get in the car. Sweet dreams, Ani. Sorry, Mr. Scarface. I'm so sorry. Now I'm going to go ahead and take this off. Okay, sweetie? Oh, part of the mess. <laughs> I hope you don't mind. Don't be scared. Come on.
Now you wait here. He'll be with you shortly. Dr. J will see you now. Pleasure to meet you.